In order to participate in the OSU Beaver Bike Rental Program, there are a few things that every biker should know to protect themselves and to protect others. Biking is a fun and easy way to get around OSU and Corvallis. It is also a great way to stay in shape and save money. In this video, we will go over the basics of bike safety, rules of the road, how to prevent bike theft, how to perform bike basic maintenance, and the do's and don'ts of biking. To follow Corvallis laws, you need a red rear reflector or light and a white headlight. A set of lights comes with your beaver bike and by law, you are required to use them at night. The beaver bike rental agreement also states that you must wear a helmet while using your rental bike. I also recommend wearing reflective gear or bright clothing when biking at night or during times of poor visibility. This will help to be seen by other cyclists, pedestrians, and vehicles. To bike safely, you need to know traffic laws. Most importantly, the basic hand signals. When you clearly signal, you allow other bikers, pedestrians, and vehicles to prepare for your stop or turn. Use your left arm because it is closest to traffic and the most visible to a car. To turn right, to turn left, and to stop. Also, if you want the rights of a pedestrian, you need to be a pedestrian. Get off your bike and walk in crosswalks and sidewalks. If you can, ride in a bike lane. It is your own lane of traffic free from pedestrians and vehicles. However, not all roads are big enough to include bike lanes. For example, on this road, you will see a share road, which indicates that cars and bikes must share the road. Bike theft is a risk on and off campus, and smart judgment about where to lock your bike can help prevent it from being stolen. With your Beaver bike, you get one lock. We recommend that you get a second lock or cable as well to protect your bike. Also, you should take the lights that come on your bike with you after you lock it, otherwise they could be stolen and you are responsible for replacing them. We advise against leaving your bike outside on campus overnight. If you must, make sure it is in a well-lit area and you have locks on both the frame and wheels. Check your tires weekly and make sure to pump them up regularly. If you get a flat tire, are in a bike accident, or anything else happens to your Beaver bike, please notify Transportation Services and take your bike to the Dixon Bike Shop to be repaired. The bike shop also provides oil to lubricate your chain if it sounds squeaky. And remember, the Transportation Services does not cover any repair fees while your Beaver bike is in use. Finally, some do's and don'ts for biking on campus. Don't ride through stop signs. Don't bike on sidewalks or through the MU Quad. Don't text and bike. Don't walk your bike to a wheelchair ramp. Don't bike the wrong way in the bike lane. Do stop for pedestrians. Do walk your bike through a crosswalk. Do make sure to wear lights, a helmet, reflective gear, and use your hand signals. Now you know the basics of how to bike around campus and how to take care of your bike. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact transportation at oregonstate.edu. Have fun and keep pedaling on.